that creepy ass flash perv scene. Talking about the flash scene. I don't like that scene. I think that scene sucks balls. <laughs> it does. I so I don't like the flash juggling wieners around. Yeah. While also so they, they in the, the same five minutes, he was like creeping on his. Yeah. I'm they, getting too into the wieners, but they, ha- they have a know. scene, and it's a woman, and him and her and Flash are like checking each other out. If you're a fan of the comics, the woman is who ends up being Flash's Iris, wife, Iris West, eventually. And so they're checking each other out, and you're like, oh, "That's fine, whatever." Flash checking out a woman, and then all of a sudden she gets in a car wreck, and the car is like flipping, and then she's like falling out of the car, and she's about to just get absolutely, <clears throat> absolutely obliterated. <laughs> she's it's done a convertible, so. so she's falling out of the car, <laughs> and so then it shows Flash in like uh, normal clothes, and he like runs out, and he's like gonna save her, but while he's like slow, this is all in slow mo. This goes on for like ten minutes, disgustingly long. It's really long. <laughs> he runs out and he's like strokes strokes her hair and her cheek. Yeah. And then and, and then like for like reasons you'll have to watch the movie, but there's also like a hot dog stand blowing up and he like grabs a wiener like while stroking her hair and people are like, mm, that's kind of weird. Maybe <laughs> sexual, maybe not. We don't know. <laughs> Here's the thing. If you're a superhero, you're like trying to save people. He's he's trying to save her, which is a nice guy thing to do. Mm. I feel like he's only trying to save her to smash. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Also, if, <laughs> if, if, you're, if you're a superhero, you don't like pause time to like non consensually like stroke a lady's face and then you're like, okay, okay, now I'll save you. It's just it's just fucked. It's just bad. <laughs> yeah, I agree. It's like a Superman was just like He's like saving a woman, and then he uses X-ray vision and catches like a bra shot. And he's like, "Oh shit! Oh shit!" It's you know, <laughs> you're right. It's basically, it's the same but different. It, it's the same. Um, this is kind of it's weird. Okay, hang on. It's less weird if you know that he's go- she's gonna be his wife. Little bit, little bit. Do you think we Amer- about- Do you think Americans give characters British accents to feel foreign? To feel like you're kind of similar to me. But you're not like we give characters as, as in white people to white people. No, you're saying do British people give characters American accents? No, do American do white American directors give white characters like Atlanteans yes. if they're white British accents yes. to feel foreign? Yes. Yeah. It doesn't have to be white. They can be black too. They can be anything. I think, but they're still British. <laughs> if Atlanteans. If the Atlantians are all black, I'm saying they're giving them British accents to be yeah. foreign. Mm-hmm. Boy, you think a fucking Atlantean's gonna stroll out of the sea talking like he's coming from Yonkers? <laughs> but British people don't do British. If British people, they've been around longer. <laughs> would British people do the same, or would they like jump? I don't shit know. Like, or we'll give them German accents. That feels foreign. Yeah, and the Germans like we to give them Russian accents. What was that? <laughs> German. <laughs> I don't know, man. Um, I think we care more than most other places. I think a British like director would film a movie and it's like an alien coming down. It's like, yeah, that dude's just British. So. <laughs> <laughs> he wouldn't give that guy like an American accent. <laughs>